as afraid of the light uh, as they are of the dark. Uh, people are as afraid of freedom uh, as they are of uh, being imprisoned. Uh, and a lot of us on the spiritual path, when we start to glimpse what liberation might look like, shrink back to our, you know, to the familiar confines of our life. We don't move toward freedom in the same way that we don't often move toward truth because it forces us to change. I mean, it forces us to move out of the status quo uh, into the unknown. And if you see the unknown as a creative place, as a, as a place where you're going to discover new things and see emptiness as full and radiant, uh, that's completely different than seeing the gap or the unknown as a void that's going to swallow you up and you're going to lose everything. Uh, so the fear of freedom and the fear of liberation and the fear of the light, in my experience, is, is as strong uh, as the fear of the darkness. You know, it's easier to hang out in the dark uh, and feel sorry for ourselves or tell us tell ourselves that it's not possible, you know, that, he, that we can't make a change. It's admitting that we can change and that, that we have choice that's the true challenge. So that, that's, that, has been, uh, that has been my experience. Thanks for that question, it's great. Thanks. What I would say is that without death, we wouldn't need spirituality. Without death, we certain, certainly wouldn't need religion. Uh, the, the reason for religion uh, comes from the awareness of our own extinction and not knowing how to deal with that information. I mean, we're the only animals on the planet that know we're going to die. And coping with that, uh, that knowledge throughout our lives is grueling. So without something to hold to, without some sense of what's larger than us or what might be coming after death, it's very hard to move through life as a mortal creature. So that's why many people are attracted to spirituality and, and, and to religion. That's how I started my path. It wasn't until my life was threatened that I started asking myself, is there anything metaphysical here? I wouldn't have done that had I not had my, my physical body not been threatened. So for me personally, there was an, a direct link uh, between the fear of dying, the awareness of the possibility uh, of mortality, uh, and, and seeking and looking for answers and looking beyond the, the obvious, beyond the, the appearance of things. That's what death encourages us to do. It's a great teacher. And it also helps you to appreciate your life. I mean, for me, spirituality is about appreciation and opening to the moment uh, and, and to, to, to a savoring life. And if we were going to live forever, that, that experience would change completely. It would just be a never-ending, you know, good time or, or you know, who, who would need any depth, who would need any, any kind of spiritual awareness.